Hey guys, I'm Els Marshall and welcome to Hey Guys. This is a brand new show where we talk about what's been going on the internet this week. Let's get into it. So KSI versus Joe Weller. So basically, they set up a boxing match, but just before that, I'm gonna tell you the backstory of it. So obviously, Joe Weller was fighting his friend, you know, he posted it on YouTube, and KSI, you know, obviously commented on Instagram, oh, I'll fight the winner, ha ha, you know what I'm saying, a little banner. But obviously, it turned a bit serious, because, you know, Joe Weller went on YouTube, like, dissing KSI, madman. I was like, what's going on? Like, when he was dissing him, I was like, rah, is this guy actually serious? He's actually dissing him. Obviously, now they're both big YouTubers. He was like, you know what? And maybe like beef KSI in the boxing match, you know, get you know some subscribers, that's there, and get some you know fans and that. When a press conference came up on upload, you know, it's like cussing each other, the crowd was going mad. So, in my opinion, yeah, well, uh, you know, I know he's a bit inch and that, you know, oh, I need to go to gym too. Much. KSI's looking strong though, so I reckon KSI maybe just, I don't know if it's gonna be a knockout, maybe a decision, but maybe just win that fight. So, it will be live streamed on KSI and Joe Willis channel from 4 p.m. GMT time, English, you know, if you're in America, you're not gonna get the same time, so don't blame me if you're missing the fight, yeah? 4 p.m. GMT on both channels on the 3rd of February, Saturday. So comment below, I wanna see who you guys think he's gonna win. Don't miss it, it's gonna be a mad thing. Next. Logan Paul is still more popular than Zoella. How? After the suicide video, what's going on? Let's go out in public and see what you guys think about this. What do you think about Logan Paul uh, having more subscribers than Zoella? Oh, I didn't knew that information, but it's a bit sad. <laughs> Logan Paul. Yeah. Okay, we're just gonna go over anyway. Uh, see how it goes. Hello, are you okay? Yeah. You're, no, not you, not, not the cameraman. The cameraman's like, I am good. Is he on? Are you good? Yeah, fine. Yeah, 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 no, he, he videoed. Ah, yeah, yeah. This guy? Yeah, the oh. guy. You don't put the like that up on YouTube. Yeah, for real. Kids, not, kids watch, kids watch. Yeah, kids watch. He has a, has a huge, like, young audience, so. But basically, um, talk about Logan Paul. No, I thought so. He's like, I don't know. What did you just, I don't understand. Okay, that was very fast. Do you, do you rap? The, the propagation of youth culture that I think uh, stereotypes and characterizes young people to be a certain way and to be a certain thing and a certain model in effect that has greater damage too. Okay, cool. Anyway, so um, don't you think Zola should have more subscribers on makeup videos are absolutely amazing? Yeah. I don't think she knows what I'm talking about, but anyway, we're gonna move on to the next question. Where you going? Uh, speaking of Zoella, she's actually looking for a social media manager and photographer. Hmm. I, yo, no, you don't need to, no, I'm not doing that, chill, I'm not applying to nothing, don't worry, I'm not, Joella, I'm not a fan, no, stop, stop filming, please, no, outside, no, please, thank you. Why is Joella gets, like, ill or something, man, just, like, step in, I don't know anything about makeup, man, would just be like, oh, uh, yeah, the eyeshadow was good, the green, yeah, eyelashes, you go, you get the eyelashes up, fake ones, yeah, get them, link in the description, you know, the foundation things, yeah, you put that in your face and that, I'll just be chatting, like, makeup language, but I'll just be saying the makeup, so I'm not making sense. So I'll be like, you know what? Forget all the makeup stuff. Forget all of that. Man's just gonna do my own thing and just chat rubbish as I normally do. You know what I'm saying? I'll get her more subscribers, definitely. You know what I'm saying? She won't have to come back. You know what I mean? All right, let's move on. YouTuber It's Aria posted a water prank video. He went out in public on the streets with a water bottle and squirted it on people. Very smart, you know what I'm saying? Like, that was a good idea. You know, if that happened to me, I wouldn't really be happy. I don't I don't really understand it's funny, you know what I mean? Like, just squirted water on them for no reason. They're just literally doing their business. And obviously they don't know if it's water or not, so. And then he used that same running music every time he ran away from the people. <laughs> right. Changed the music, bro. You know, smacking drinks out of people's hands. Bro, why? Just why? So obviously I was scrolling through uh, Snapchat, Instagrams, and I see on Aria's social media that his channel shut down. So I was like, rah. All right, so uh, some career advice for Aria, you know, Dr. Marshall's here to help. There's loads of things you can do on YouTube. Please don't do pranks that aren't people, you know what I'm saying? Like, see there's that coin magic trick, you know, when they, you know, they're like, oh, it's a, it's a magic trick. Oh, you can see a coin and stuff, and then they squirt it in their face. Like the one I've seen on Vine or on Instagram and stuff like that, when they actually get a bottle of water and they uh, squeeze it in the cubicles, in the toilets, and that like it's a uh, weave. See, that's a prank, you know what I'm saying? Like, the other one's not really pranks, they're just annoying. There's always like Sainsbury's and, and Tesco. You can do both, maybe, I don't know. You could maybe do a bit of 
you know what I'm saying? These are not maybe fish and chip shop down the road. You know what I'm saying? There's jobs out there, so don't worry, man. Anyway, next. So apparently, whales can speak. Wait, what? Hello? <laughs> oh, it actually said hello. I don't, I don't know what's going on, but I feel like I'm in a science lesson. This is this is really educational. Is that done? I don't know. I need a world like that, man. I need a world. I know I can't have it in my house, but you know, I still get one somehow. That's crazy. Animal speaking now. It, no, it, it, said, it said hello. No, I'm, it said hello. It's, it's like the world's improving. So these orca whales imitate human speech. I don't know how that's happened. I don't know how humans can get whales to speak. Maybe they're just like, hello, hello. Like, they just keep saying words to them and they just, whales just randomly be like, you know what, I've had enough. I've had enough of you speaking human speech to me, human language, I'm just gonna join in. So I'm imagining like whales in the ocean, they speak to each other like, all right, what are you saying? Are you going, you're going to get some fish and that? You're gonna go and eat some fish? All right, I'm coming with you, you know what I mean? Like, it's like going to the shop. You know when people say you go to your friend, you're like, I don't wanna go shop. They like, say it in the world language, they're like, Hey, yo, come, come get some fish, man. Oh, let me get some fish. Oh, I, I thought, what was that? I thought, I, maybe that happens in the ocean. You don't know, maybe. Did I say maybe? You, no one knows, you know what I mean? They might have to be like, hey, let, come, come, let's go to some party, man. No, but it's just bare wells there, just dance. Okay, what happens in the ocean stays in the ocean. But anyway, I'm just going on and on. Let's go to the next one. <laughs> Dumb water bottle pranks on YouTube. YouTubers fighting, Logan Paul, Zoella, and talking whales. The internet's gone mad this week. Anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Make sure you follow us at MTV UK and at Ells Marshall One. I'll see you guys next week.